Digital A11Y Insights. Your accessibility partner. Accessibility for all technology for everyone. Hello everyone. Today we're going to talk about accessibility bookmarklets. Before we start the session, let's understand what is a bookmarklet. Traditionally, when you have a link, the address it leads to starts with HTTPS. You very likely notice that these are the prefixes that you also see in the search bar while scouring the web. Well, that's just a really long way of saying that normally links lead to websites. However, links do not have to start with HTTPS. They can also start with JavaScript. Bookmarklets contain JavaScript that can be run on any web page. It helps web developers and designers see the entire perspective on websites and help view hidden accessibility information on web pages. For example, HTML markup like lists, headings, and labels, etc. But how do we make a bookmarklet? One way of making bookmarklet is writing JavaScript code that you want in a bookmarklet using console. The most common and easy way of installing a bookmarklet is to drag and drop the bookmarklet link into your browser's bookmarks. Now, let's talk about installation and usage. Bookmarklets work on most of the browsers, but let's discuss in detail about the installation steps on Google Chrome. To show the bookmarks bar in Chrome, press Ctrl plus Shift plus B. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus O to bring up Bookmark Manager. Then go to these three dots in Chrome, click on it, or select the Organize button menu. Select Add New Bookmark and then you can name the bookmark and in URL, you can copy and paste the JavaScript. Don't forget to press save. Once installed, these bookmarklets can interact with most web pages. To activate, click a bookmarklet in your bookmarks or favorite bar. To deactivate, simply click it again or refresh your page. It will also be deactivated if you resize your window or navigate to another page. This is the end of the video. Thank you for joining. If you like the video, do like and subscribe.